I want to share with you one message that's been made crystal clear for me in the past few weeks, and that's really been liberating. Um, it's filled my life with possibility and excitement in a way that's really been wild, and I think it could do the same for you. You know, I remember when I was a child, I had all these visions of who I could be, the person that I wanted to become. And those visions didn't end after childhood. I still have all these crazy ideas that I could accomplish, the way that I could behave, the leader I could be, the person I could be in relationships, all these crazy artistic ideas. And I might have a few more than most, but I know that you have ideas like that too. And, you know, as I grew older, some of them I actualized on, I took action on. But very, very many of them fell to the wayside. It could be because I was busy, because I didn't need to execute on them. But most frequently, if I'm being honest, because I was afraid. I was afraid to put myself out there. You know, what if everyone didn't like it? What if they made fun of me? What if it failed terribly? What if I loved someone completely and, you know, she didn't love me back at all? Or something happened? Or what if I made this project and I went for it and after all my hard work, it failed? You know, and for a long time that held me back. And what I've noticed in the past few weeks as, you know, death has become more of a reality. And that doesn't mean I think I'm going to die, but people are getting sick and people are dying before they thought they were going to die. You know, and that urgency seeped into me and I started to get nervous. And what I'm seeing is all of a sudden, all those fears, they, they're just falling away. I don't have time to worry about that. I have to go for it. This is my only chance. If I don't go for it now, then when? You know, I can't assume the future is going to look the same as it was yesterday. I can't assume everything's going to be the same and I can make plans for later. It's got to be now. And this is really always true. I mean, this is one instance of death, but people die prematurely all the time. We don't know how things are going to go. We can't assume that we have time. And really, in every moment, we're dying a little bit. We're losing a moment, losing an opportunity, a day older, a day older. A, one more day that's in the past that'll never come back. And really, we don't have the luxury to wait on these things. If you have a vision of who you want to be, if I have a vision of who I want to be, I, I'm going to wait. I'm going to let the opportunity pass. I'm going to live as not that person. It's got to be now. So, you know, in the past few weeks, I've been, you know, going wild with creativity. I've been making music. I've been making videos. I've been taking chances in business. I've been putting myself out there. And look, I'm definitely afraid. I don't know if this is going to work. Uh, but I do know that I'm going for it. And I do know that when I look back at my life, I don't regret for a second one of those moments that I went for it, where I was brave. And that's not to say that you know, everything will work out. Just follow your passion and everything is going to work out. I'm not saying that. You're going to go for it and you're going to fail. You're going to love someone and they're not going to love you back or God forbid they're going to pass away and you're going to be filled with pain. But you'll always have that knowledge that you were who you were meant to be. That you took the chances, that you were brave. And this applies to any stage you are in life, whether you're a student trying to decide where to go to college, I say, go for it. Take the chance, take the risk. You're an adult trying to figure out what to do in business, if you should just work for someone else, you know, just get a job, follow the safe or consistent plan, or you have this crazy idea that you want to go for, go for it, go for it, <laughs> go for it. Or you're an artist and you have this music that you want to put out there. Put it out there. And that's not saying everyone will love it. It's not saying that at all. It's not saying that you'll make it. You know, you have a girl that you like, go for it. Doesn't mean she's going to like you. She might hate you, but at least you'll know you went for it. Get it out of the way. It didn't work. Next. Or you went for it. You got to a certain point. You hit failure. And you're at a future point where you could look out and make moves. You'll never regret taking those steps. Never. I just watched Goodwill Hunting, and that's really the message of that movie. If you saw it, you'll know what I'm talking about. You know that, just go, just try it. A lot of movie time during uh, quarantine. So that's really the message to you. And I have one more piece that I want to add to this. I always thought that, you know, others don't want me to step up. Others won't like it. You know, I'm going to be outshining them or something like that. Others don't care. Others want you to step up, in fact. They want a leader. They want someone brave. They want to see you succeed. We need you to succeed. 
We need every one of you watching this to step up and to accomplish great things, to lift those around you up, to be bold and brave. And together, we could go for it. We don't have to have an environment where we're all so afraid, afraid of making a mistake, afraid of getting hurt. Death is here. Death is the enemy. Death is the thing that one day is coming for us all and the time is ticking. So if you have a vision of who you want to be, if you have an idea, if you have a story, if something you want to chase, then take this time, chase it, go for it. And I think that you'll find you'll live happier, more rewarding life because of it.